everything settled with the angels, luckily. All right. I just want to clear some stuff up. I don't want you feeling some type of way. The whole um gunner shit. That was that was <laughs> fucked up, man. Honestly, holy shit. It was just some fucking dumbass SBS shit that we decided to do on the fly. Gunner is a uh, he's he's kind of a fucking cracker, you know. We knew he wouldn't actually do anything to severely fuck you guys over. We just wanted to fuck shit up a little bit. You know, we were getting told left and right that people were making it seem like Randy's sad. Uh, uh, you know, he's getting fucked over uh, uh, because you left him for Tommy and all this stuff. Oh, God. Whether true or not. I mean, obviously, you know, people. It's not true. Yeah, it's exactly. not like that at all. Because people were going around just spreading a whole bunch of shit, making it seem like crazy stuff. And then I would talk to Randy. He would say something else. I'll talk to fucking Taco. He would say something else. Everyone was saying some other shit, right? Yeah. So yeah, we, we, we did some fucked up shit. It was drastic, but I just want you to know it was, it was lighthearted. It was never to actually fuck you guys over anything. I believe you. And honestly, it was a wake up call. Like I honestly, all I want to do is make money and grind down. Like I'm so tired of the drama. Yeah, so it, it's it, it's tiring. We've been down this path before, right? And it always gets to a point where it gets too fucking serious and too crazy and too many things going on and nobody can see straight down the line because there's just so yeah. many things involved and so many people involved. And listen, I want you to know you're doing a fucking amazing in the city. Okay, don't feel otherwise. Are you sure? Hundred percent, hundred percent. This is not your fault whatsoever. I mean, there's no really anyone at fault. There's nothing bad that happened. But as a group, know. you know, I feel like I'm causing a riff no, and even no, Gunner no, no, said no, I'm no. making chain gang worse. <laughs> That's because Gunner is just talking shit. You know what I mean? You don't have to worry about he's Gunner. He's fucking mean, man. He's, he's, he's fucking crazy. No, you, you're doing a fucking great. And what you're doing is fine. You can continue doing this stuff. But uh, no. as a gang, a lot of people have been noticing over time is just like and i think it's because we stopped doing the casino for for reasons and there was why no why did we stop uh it's it's, it's kind of deep it's hard to really explain we just uh it wasn't for us i guess hmm. but um yeah so i mean and then i was doing my detective shit so everyone was kind of spread out and there was just really no communication in the gang and um People just felt like they, you know, they weren't involved in stuff or didn't know what was going on. And then it got to the point where people just were afraid to like intrude on people's business because they didn't want to bother them. And that's just not how, you know, it should be. You know, people should have no problem calling each other and asking to be a part of stuff. You know, I want you to feel uncomfortable. Yeah. Honestly, I'm, I'm feeling a bit better now that I've settled things with the angels and I uh don't worry about randy and i there wasn't anything really but yeah but you, I, know, you know people were making it seem like it's a whole big thing, yeah you know? it was crazy I, i'm learning a lot about this city i learned a lot oh, it could today get crazy especially. real quick yeah anything can spiral just know at the end of the day we will have your back you know and i, I want you to start you know doing some more stuff with the gang you know maybe doing I some stuff to. with some more people and i could help with that introduce you yeah and, yeah, no, I'd, I'd love to. I, I I mean, I'm getting a super. I need to save up for it. I, I need work. I need to do some crime. I need to do it all. Yeah, and I can, you know, get you involved in stuff. If you want to do drug game, we can get you. We, has, we, we we got our hands in pretty much everything. We have clean business. We have drugs, heist, guns. I'm um, pretty much working for Vinny right yeah, now. Yeah, Vinny told me you're moving the thermite. thermite. Like, stuff like that. We got stuff for everybody. So when people come yeah. and they tell us what we want to do, we make it happen for them. That's what it's all about. And we help each other and... And if you see yeah. someone's kind of just chilling, bored, not having nothing to go on, you know, invite him along, give him a little something to do. That's what we always been about. But I'm sorry. I'm sorry about the gun of shit. You know, I was fucking around. I didn't mean it to make anyone feel type of way. It yeah, was me, Hutch, I, Rami. We're just like, oh, gunner would be the perfect crack at that. <laughs> I know you guys shit. are like that. You guys. Yeah, we do fuck with each other. Yeah. And I just. Like the shit we do to each other, a lot guard. of people will look at it and be like, the fuck? These guys hate each other? <laughs> yeah, I, I thought maybe, you know, you guys were just fucking with me because of the whole Randy situation. So I, I took it to heart, you know? No, no, yeah. This this was not you at all. 
This was just this was happening even before any relationship shit, you know? Yeah. It's just because we That's stopped cool. the casino and then we never really we always as a group we always had something we're working towards. Like we were working towards the, the vault, cracking the vault and the lower vault and the yacht stuff and then the VR and then the casino. And then we kinda got stopped dead in the tracks in the casino and then I started the detective shit and everyone was just like, oh you know. And the gang yeah. kinda just came to a halt. That's it. I really like that we had a meeting today. I feel like we need those more often. Yeah, you know, felt sometimes, like we were actually progressing together. Yeah, people just gotta communicate and get this shit out there. Even the angel shit, you know? You yeah. did nothing wrong. But it was just, we didn't know the whole fucking story before going in there, you know? Mm -hmm. But if we communicated as a gang, we would know exactly what was going on. And... Yeah, I agree. All right, I gotta, I think I need to lie down. It's been a long day, Mr. K. Yeah, yeah. Keep your head up. You're doing great. And uh, just know, we got your fucking back no matter what. Right or wrong. Thanks, K. If you ever have like a job for me or if you have room or something, please invite me. Of course. If you ever want to get into some other stuff, let me know. I could, I could introduce you to whoever, make you connections, all that stuff. Okay. Thank you. All right. Take care. True. The guy. Yeah, you're right. The guy has been pretty fucking big. Um. I think with uh Ray, I don't know. Maybe she's um not nervous or just I think what it is with her, she's very comfortable with Rami and uh Randy, right? So she, you know Obviously you go to the people you're comfortable with. But I think it'll be um really good to start having the gang more incorporated with each other, intertwined. That's the whole point, right? You have a network of people you could intertwine with and do stuff and progress forward with. Simple as that. I don't want anyone to feel like, uh, I don't want doing anything wrong. As a gang, we just had to get our shit back on track. Cause that's the point of having a gang, right? Is being intertwined with each other and shit wasn't intertwined. 